Hello and welcome to today's video. Today we're going to be talking about hand sanitizer and how you can make it at home. Hello and welcome back to our channel. If you haven't already, please consider hitting the subscribe button below and clicking on the bell icon to be notified when all of our new videos do come out each and every week. So today we're going to be talking about hand sanitizer. So with the coronavirus scare, even though I think it's a lot of media hype and stuff, yeah, I know people are dying from it, but not at the levels of the flu. Uh, we all have hand sanitizer around as it is, and it's becoming more and more of a scarce commodity. I've read reports from the New York Times and all over, if you just Google it, that stores are running out of this hand sanitizer all over the world right now. So if you guys are like us, coronavirus flu season, no matter what, we still need it and use it all the time. So with all that being said, we're going to show you how you can make some hand sanitizer at home with a couple of really simple ingredients. So the big ingredients that you're going to need are aloe vera gel, and you can just get the cheap stuff. I just got the green gel stuff at the store. This was like four or five bucks for the, the big jug, as well as some isopropyl alcohol. You got to make sure to get the strongest stuff you can get at the store. Uh, this stuff is 91%. I wouldn't get anything less. If you can get 99%, that's even better. And the other things you're going to need are a bottle. This is just a three ounce bottle. Uh, it's got a little uh, flip top uh, so you can get the stuff out. You can also use a pump if you got that too. That'll work just as well. And then I also got some essential oils. Uh, in this case, I'm going to use lavender, but you can use any scent that you really like. So really, we, we're going to want a like a two thirds to a one third mixture. So we're going to want two thirds of the alcohol to one third of the aloe vera gel. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour a third of this full of alcohol. The next third, I'm going to do aloe vera gel and my essential oils and then alcohol on top, and then I'm gonna shake it, and it just combines easier. So we'll start with our third of alcohol. Doesn't have to be exact. Put my gel in. Now I'm gonna put four to five drops of this lavender essential oil in. And then I'm gonna fill it the rest of the way up with alcohol. We need to make sure to leave a, just a little bit of space at the top for air, and that'll help it mix when we're all done. We'll go ahead and recap it. So after it's been recapped, you can kind of see there's a couple of different levels in there where you get the gel on the bottom and the alcohol on top. So we're just gonna go ahead, make sure it's nice and tight, and shake it to combine. So what you're gonna notice is the alcohol and the gel don't really go together at first. It'll take time for them to, to kind of emulsify together, but you'll notice at first they kind of separate after you shake. So if you use it right away, you just gotta make sure to shake it, and then you can use it. So for now, that looks good though. So let's go ahead and pour some out and we'll try it. <clears throat> yep, definitely smells like hand sanitizer. It's good, it smells like lavender, it smells like the alcohol so it's killed uh, basically everything on my hands. So there you go, um, pretty simple. It is a little bit more runny than your normal hand sanitizer, but if you uh, use some stuff like hospitals, um, other places, it's not as gelatinized as the Purell stuff is, so this stuff will actually work really well. So if you guys have any suggestions, questions, go ahead and put them in the comments below. Also, we have a new store opened up on Threadless. The link is below in the description. We got some coffee mugs, t-shirts, that kind of thing, so please check that out as well. Also, if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing and clicking on the bell icon to be notified when all of our videos do come out each and every week. Thanks a lot, y'all. Have a good one.